Marisa Mertz is the only woman artist who is associated with the Arte Povera movement. This is a very important group of artists in the Italian avant-garde after World War II who were working with kind of poor materials, materials that were at hand. So she would use found objects, um, often interested in, I would say, narrative moments within a space, kind of scattered style of installation making, um, scattering materials such as felt or wax, which would change over time, over the course of an exhibition. In the late 1960s, early 1970s, copper wire became one of her signature kind of materials. So what becomes interesting about this from this very early time is her incorporation of the knitting but also of the labor of the domestic realm in a way. I would say the labor of her own maternity. This gets incorporated into not only her installations, but in these small objects that she begins to knit. So she knits small shoes for her daughter. Around the mid-1970s, she begins also to use the image of a face or a head, and she starts to explore this face in ceramic works, these small ceramic heads, often working just with a small block of clay. Marissa Mertz's wet work plays beautifully with space and although she no longer travels and no longer participates in the installation of her work, we had the opportunity, which is extremely exciting, to add many new works to this show for Porto. So many of the works that you will see in the galleries here come directly from the artist studio and were only seen in this museum um, for the European tour of this exhibition.